You're brave, but you're also very stupid. It's Ash from Super Videos, back for another reaction to an episode of Black Summer. This is my reaction to Season 2, Episode 7. We only have two more episodes till the end of the second season. I think the third season was not renewed, so there's only two seasons, which is not really great when it comes to watching this series this late, but it is what it is. I started it before Season 3 was cancelled, so I have to finish it in a way, because I want to see what happens at the end, obviously, but this episode is called The Lodge. They've been trying to get to the lodge for a little bit now, and it looks like they will in this episode. We know that Rose found this place at the end of last episode, from what I remember. So let's see what happens in this episode and how it sets up the finale and what happens in the finale. Obviously, because there's no third season, whatever happens in the finale is probably going to be, I don't want to say pointless, but it's not going to matter because there is no continuation. But I still want to see how they ended up finishing this part of the story as they have it so far but with that said before we dive into it smash the like button subscribe to join our community and press the bell to be notified when i upload on the channel with that said let's dive right into this reaction it started with a gun so i hope there is more action in this episode is this inside the lodge Who's that? Oh, that's Rose. So they ended up finding some place, unless this is a flashback. That's some good chocolate cake right there. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it's the lodge. The same one that they saw from a distance. Yep, yeah, that's the trio. That's what I said! <laughs> you might want to check the place first. There could be other humans, there could be zombies. Don't just go marching in and letting yourselves be known. What an idiot. You believe me now? Huh? Yes, now shut the hell up. He does not like quiet. That's for sure. Hey! Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Stay together. See? I wasn't lying. <sighs> Have you checked the place fully? I doubt it. This place is huge, though. If they can secure it... Oh, look at this! We got water, we got food. Then... We got heat. Yeah, they have everything. We got electricity. <laughs> I mean, it's not going to last forever, but it's something. Looks like a beautiful place, not going to lie. Apocalypse or not. <laughs> oh. He's going to go ahead and play some drums. Which is going to attract zombies. Yeah. Uh -uh. Sorry. He does not like to just shut the hell up. Sweet dreams, girls. That's not a good sound. Looks like the roof is collapsing. You want to take a shower? I'll wash your hair. I'm good. You go first. Sweet dreams. The guy said sweet dreams, girls, right? So that's where that comes from. But I doubt it'll be sweet dreams. The daughter is awfully quiet. Hope she's okay. She is. <laughs> Mom. We leave tomorrow? What do you mean we leave tomorrow? Okay, good. You should stay here for a little you bit. Sure, you feel better. I know you don't trust the place, but don't just immediately leave. Do you remember how I used to get you to sleep? I'd sing. Please don't. I love you so much. You're stupid. Don't worry about tomorrow, okay? 
We should have gotten something like this earlier. Get there. I feel like she's been Before grown you... up for enough time for us to have seen something Again, like this. I promise you. They didn't need to wait till the end to have something like this. And that's another criticism that I have. There's lots of time jumps and we don't really Take see the characters pain. grow and develop. So I feel like that's a big part of why I'm not connecting with the series so far. Yeah, Obviously, I'm like fine. I said, there's no the third season, so it doesn't even matter anymore, but... With the one... Something is going to happen. I just know it. Who broke into the bakery. Someone's going to come. Something is definitely going to go wrong. Ghosts? There are no ghosts in a zombie show. <laughs> ghosts are the least of their worries. Yep, she got up. Now definitely something is going to happen. Yeah, someone's going to come in. The angle is just perfect for that. Someone's going to sneak in. And the fact that we don't know what the guy is doing makes it even worse. Because I don't trust the guy. I don't like the guy. You're brave, but you're also very stupid. That's all I'm saying. Because going there by yourself is a mistake. It's probably like a zombie. But they never heard anything earlier, so... I don't know. Unless the guy let someone in or someone just snuck in. That sounds loud. Did the banging stop? Nope. What's with the red? They were here earlier. There was nothing. Oh. This is kind of creepy. <laughs> she has some lady-sized nuts, like Negan would say, from Walking Dead, for those that don't know. <laughs> Why is that door open? Someone could easily have snuck in, so this place is not safe until you secure it what is going on what is she doing <laughs> that was kind of creepy by itself footprints i guess they're continuing the theme of ghosts and footprints and all of that. <laughs> it's morning. Where is the guy? That's what I want to know. Is he still in his room? We should go check up on him. Is that the guy? I don't like that. Who was that? Who the hell was that? Wake up your mom. You might need her assistance here. I mean, you needed it earlier, but you didn't get it, so... <laughs> You're probably not gonna get her help. You feel like you can do it by yourself. Yeah, go check up on the guy. So it wasn't him. Someone's in there with you. I actually really enjoy the way this episode is filmed. It has like a horror vibe with the camera work and the cinematography. And it works in this episode. And I think that's why they went with the ghosts and footprints idea as title cards for the episode. Is there another door that's open? 
this place does have ghosts. Because there was literally someone at your door. Oh, there's finally some zombies. But the question is, why didn't you notice that before? What did you see? What did you see? Resurrection? Zombies? Makes sense. Is the mom finally gonna wake up? Wake up, Rose. Your daughter is acting dumb. She's gonna go save her, obviously. She's gonna look up and not see her daughter in front. Come on, notice faster that she's not there. Anna? There we go. <laughs> Anna? She looks like she's angry. <laughs> she should be concerned. Wow. Where the fuck is my daughter? She's not with you? Oh, that's why it said resurrection. What's up, Rose? That was a good reunion. I wasn't expecting to see him. The Last Supper? These titles, man. <laughs> Where did they get all that food? I mean, I know the place had food, but... This is next level type of supper. You know, <laughs> 30 or 40 days worth of propane? At least, at least a, a year of like drinks, food, supplies. I told her. Didn't I tell you? I did tell you, didn't I? I did tell you. Hi. <laughs> then I told you about this place. Yes, you told us. Now shut up. I told her. <laughs> She didn't believe me, but I told her. <laughs> all to the racks, all to the tanks. Check all the rooms. Nope, they did not. Fuck, I, of course I check all the rooms. No, you didn't. What? You didn't check all the rooms because they are here. <laughs> what about the airstrip? Fuck the airstrip. Yeah, fuck the airstrip. You hear what I'm saying? I'm leaning real towards fuck it right about now. I'll take a roof over my head and a hot plate. Sounds about right. And then what? There's no airstrip. Nope. He said there was. Oh. He said. Yeah. Unless he's a liar. Yes. He hey, I don't lie. I told you I don't lie. I, I, I always tell the truth. There was a lie. So it's there. Yeah, fuck yeah, it's there. And it's close. Yes! Then why stay here? You didn't say we should stay here. Yes, he did. No, no, no. What I said. He said we could stay here. That's right. Listen to your mama, okay? Fuck you. Hey! Damn. No disrespect here! I want, I want no trouble. I want no trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like someone's just gonna kill the guy. Like that. <laughs> He's just a little tired, is all. Mm, of course. <laughs> It's been a long journey. Well, tell me about it. Because you you guys go way back, right? Yes, they oh, do. Yeah. It's like... It's a little salmon. Swimming upstream. What is he talking about? <laughs> He's it's had a little too much to drink. 
That's safe to say. Only he was cuckoo before anyway. having drinks. People that want to always go somewhere else. Always looking for a, gold, a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. That's true, though. My dear. You can find heaven on earth if you want to. You know? Or hell! If you choose to. Why is Rose not saying anything? That's what I want to know. <laughs> She's you like observing everything. <laughs> observing. And then she's gonna go ahead and put people in their place. Maybe there isn't anywhere else. Maybe it's better to stay put. Maybe it's better to just... Ride this thing out. Be on the same page. <laughs> yeah. That's easy for you to say. Oh, yeah? Why's that? You know. Was there a history between them? Yeah. I don't remember. No, no, no. Let her talk. Go ahead. Tell me why. Because you're dying. Hey. Oh, that. Is he, though? It looks fine to me. It's been a long road. Is that what this whole conversation was about? <sighs> Went over my head. She's tired. <laughs> Let me tell you a story. Please do. You see... This guy's weird. I've been dead. I've seen it. Fell aside, all that shit. I believe you. Believe it, brother? I was lying in a ditch. Among the dead. Left for the rats and maggots. Oh, they left her, I think. If I remember right. I've been dead. I'm sorry to hear this. But I got up. <sighs> Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> you can say that. <laughs> well, that was quite a conversation. Is she gonna clear out the rooms? Terrible idea by herself. Looks like there's a lot of them in there. Standoff? Hmm. That is quite a standoff already. I can only look out for her. No one else. Understandable. It is crystal fucking clear. My life has one meaning. And it's her. So everybody else can just get the fuck out. Because you're probably going down. Damn. That's quite an angle. So, I'm not sorry. I wish I was. But I'm not. You're on the same team, though. So let's just nice get past that we're tired. and get on the same page. Bygones. Let bygones be bygones. I'm gonna check on dessert. Dessert? <laughs> that was a cool transition. We're back to the start of the episode. Oh! What the fuck did you do? We're leaving. What the hell? What? What is wrong with you, girl? Why? 
I like the guy. Why? Now I'm pissed at her. Why? I still can't get over it. You're an idiot, girl. Truly an idiot. He was my favorite survivor alongside Rose. And then she killed him like that. These writers. <laughs> Come on. How do you kill your best character just like that? Wait. Oh, now we're going back. Okay. See what led to that. I hope she didn't just go shoot him. I hope he did something. Where is she? No. Every time I close my eyes, I figure they're going to stay that way. But somehow, I got waking up. Maybe I was waiting for someone. You hear what I'm saying? <laughs> See, that's why I fucks with you. Your little ass stay ready. You don't miss nothing. You were right about it. I've been going for a while now, but I couldn't. Not there. Not like that. Not like the rest of them. But, uh, I finally found my spot to rest. Oh, so he's asking to be killed? Is that what happened? That's all I want. It's a little rest. But, um, I couldn't myself. Mm. Because you never know. So, um, can you help? Yeah, I feel that? different about it now. <laughs> I do the same for you. So, she's not a little psychopath. Okay. Well, kind of, but. Devastating, man. There you go. Now I don't feel too bad about it or as bad about it, but he was still a pretty good character. I didn't want him to die this early. Well, I mean, there's no third season, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> but still. All right, that was my reaction to season one, episode seven of Black Summer, which was called The Lodge. This was a pretty good episode, very solid. I really liked the style they went with in this episode. As far as the camera work and cinematography and the way that they made it feel like a horror movie, I really liked that. I also loved the ending as far as the dual perspective that led to, you know, the big death from this episode. I still don't think that it's a good idea to kill or it was a good idea to kill off the character this early, but I understand from a story perspective and also because there's no third season, it doesn't really matter. But I really, really enjoyed this episode. This is probably one of my favorite episodes of Black Summer that I can think of. It had a lot of different layers, different, you know, perspectives, different 
things coming together. And also I love the dual perspective at the end of it. But with that said, I hope you enjoyed this reaction. If you did, smash the like button, subscribe to join our community and press the bell to be notified when I upload on the channel. That's it for this video. See you next time for another super video.